I was born in London and I grew up in Cape Town and I studied in New York and now I live in Toronto, Canada. And I'm immensely fortunate to have lived in so many places, but it does make me feel like I could belong anywhere and therefore I don't really belong anywhere. And that's where the title of the album, Nowhere Girl, comes from. It's been 10 years since I last released an LP, a full album. And what have I been doing? I'm not quite sure because time moves so quickly the older we get. But I think that in that time, I've been able to take these songs, write them, edit them, rewrite them. And I hope that the result is something that is very lean, but also very vibrant. The less is more aesthetic is something that really appeals to me, but it's something that I've learned over time is incredibly hard to achieve. I saw you go out wondering Your head bowed silently Your tennis socks pulled up Made cuff your shorts above the knee I didn't ask to join you I wasn't so inclined But if I'd run it by you I know you wouldn't mind The music on this album blurs the lines between jazz, singer-songwriter, and folk traditions. I think typically within jazz, we often hear R&B and jazz kind of fused together. I think that jazz singer-songwriter is a term that is becoming a lot more prevalent. And what it means to me, really, is that I'm focusing on the integrity of the song. When I moved to Canada, my goal was to find like-minded musicians and to find people who I felt celebrated the idea of song, but also the spirit of collaboration, which is something that is central to jazz. So the musicians on this album very much came to the party when it comes to that shared goal. And so any improvising had to happen within 20 bars or eight bars. And I was really surprised that Ernesto, Dan, Chris, Tara, Julio, Lila, they were all really happy for those parameters and they celebrated what they meant for the songs that we were creating. Oh my land. Very often when we record albums, we don't go into it with there being a scene. Sometimes an album is a concept album. And I didn't go into this, it's taken 10 years to make this record, so I had these songs, some of them were written a decade ago, others were written in the last two, three years. And so the, it's interesting how the theme of this album, of Nowhere Girl, has kind of revealed itself. There are two themes that are woven throughout these songs, identity and belonging. And I'm glad for that because those are universal themes. There are a million and one ways for someone to take those threads and apply them to their own life. And I really like that. And I also think that they are parts of life that never reach a final resting place. Oh, oh. 